Hello friends, welcome back to online mass hub. So we have uh, this uh, problem right there to solve. So this is x power x is equal to 45. And so we want to find out the value of x that satisfies this equation right here. Okay, so just before we proceed, if you are new to our channel, do well to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and also turn on the notification icon so that if we release new content, you will actually get to know about it. Of course, if you are watching us on Facebook, do well to also like our video, follow us on, on our page, and uh, also share this video to your friends so that they will also get to know about it. Okay, so to proceed with the solvents, I am just going to take the natural log of both sides. So what I'm going to be having is natural log of x power x here is equal to the natural log of 45 okay and uh, of course i'm going to utilize the rule of logarithm i'm going to i'm going to bring this uh, x down here so that what i have is x natural log of x is equal to the natural log of 45 here okay so the next thing i want to do is actually to make some substitution and of course you can remember that we can write this x here as exponential natural log of x of course exponential of natural log is one and then one times x gives us the same as x so i'm going to replace this with x here so that i have that this now becomes the exponential natural log of x and then multiply by natural log of x okay is equal to the natural log of 45 okay so moving on i'm going to bring this one here so that i have that this now becomes the natural log of x exponential the natural log of x is equal to the natural log of 45 okay so i'm going to be utilizing the uh, lambert w function right here and of course, if you can remember that if you have a function a exponential a, and then you pass a lambda double function to it, it's actually going to be giving you a. So, of course, you can see that we've got a pattern of this a exponential a right there. So, we our a in this case is natural log of x. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is just to go ahead to pass a lambda double function there and if i do that i'm going to be having the number w function of natural log of x exponential the natural log of x okay it's equal to the lambda w function of the natural log of 45 okay so that this uh, left hand side not collapses to natural log of x is now equal to the lambda w function of natural log of 45 okay and then moving on i can take the exponential of both sides so that i can be able to move this uh, natural log right here okay so that i now have the exponential of natural log of x is equal to the exponential of the lambda w function of natural log of 45 exponential of uh, this natural log here gives me one and then one times x here gives me x okay and it's equal to exponential of the lambda w function of the natural log of 45 so okay so the next thing we want to do is actually to move over to go from alpha.com to be to go and compute this and then we'll put the answer right here once you come over to go from alpha.com okay you can see the website right here and then you just go ahead and type in the function over here so you're gonna be typing this exponential uh, lambda w function of uh, log 45 and then once you're done doing that you can go ahead to uh, type on this equal equality sign and then of course it's actually going to solve that right away so you can see how a function appears and then when you go down here you see the uh, decimal approximation of this function so you can see these long numbers right here so i'm just gonna uh, be approximating it so i'm just gonna be picking the first uh, four decimal places okay so and of course i'm gonna be having 3.239 uh, okay and of course that is gonna be our answer 3.239 
course we have approximated this to four decimal to four decimal places okay so uh, this is actually going to be the value of x that would satisfy the problem we are solving okay so and of course that is basically how you go about solving problems like this if you've understood it let me have your thought in the comment section and of course if you have any questions do drop in it in the comment section too and then i'm going to get back to you and of course do well to like this video and then subscribe to the channel for more updates and i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye